everyone, it's Dorka. The summer is over and this is the day when I fly back to Taiwan. I haven't started packing yet, so my flight leaves at 8pm in the night, so luckily I have all day to pack everything. And since this is the third time when I move abroad, and not just abroad but to the other end of the world basically, uh, I want to share how I pack with you. I feel like I'm quite experienced in this, so I hope this will be helpful for you and I can show you some tips and tricks on how to pack really efficiently. Though I need to say that um, my packing process will be a little bit easier this time because most of my winter stuff is left in Taiwan, so I don't have to bother about that. And I'm also coming home for Christmas this year, so I'm going to pack for basically three months right now. It's gonna be mostly clothes and I will also show you the other kind of things that I'm taking because I'm taking some like food and toiletries. So I will try to do some time lapses and some like normal clips explaining what I'm doing. I hope you will enjoy it and let's get started with packing. She's not making this process any easier though. As I was filming this clip, she just decided that the best place to sleep right now is right in my lap. She's so adorable, I wish I could pack her as well. Look at that. So I do have some other knickknacks that are not here, but these are mostly the non-clothing items that I'm taking. So I have here some like soups. I really like this kind and you cannot get it in Taiwan. And like some other um, spices. This is paprika cream. Um, yeah, I'm taking these vanilla aromas. There I have my supplements, BCAAs and protein all in Ziploc bags because it's easier to transport. I will also put all my um, vitamins in Ziploc bags just to make everything easier. So it's basically mostly vitamins and medicine and food. I have a few shoes there. That is my um, suitcase that I'm gonna use. There's a smaller one inside that is gonna be my carry-on. And um, yeah, let's get started. My first and biggest tip is to use packing cubes for packing your clothes. They're such a lifesaver, you guys. Um, so basically what a packing cube is, it looks like this. It's a really light material, so you don't have to worry about adding some extra weight for your stuff. So you basically put your clothes in it. I recommend rolling because I found that, the mo that to be the most um, space efficient method for clothing. So you roll your clothes, you put them in here and then you zip the mesh top on it. Um, and it compresses the clothes a little bit so you can stuff so many clothes in it. Um, you can save a lot of space. And I found like after I fill it up completely, I can usually put some uh, some more items at the top if I just um, fold them flat. So they are really really great. I ordered them online, but you can also get them at stores like Muji. Um, I used to have one set, these blue ones, uh, but I think I lost one and I don't know, they're just so good and actually so cheap that I decided to order another set. So that's what I'm going to use for packing my clothes and also for packing some tops um, if I don't have enough of these cubes I usually use some Ziploc bags as well okay let's see what I have prepared so far <clears throat> I opened all my closets and started going through the clothes and everything that I want to take I just put on my bed so let's see so first of all, I have my gym clothes here. These are my shorts, my sports bras, my gym pants, and all my workout tops. And then I have all my like uh, sleeveless and short sleeve tops that I want to take. My pants, some like flowy pants and skirts, some chill at home kind of like pants and shorts, two swimsuits. And then at the back, I have my cardigans. And here I have some like summer dresses and blouses and some other tops that I usually hang. So obviously I still need my um, underwear, but I think mostly this is it. Hmm. 
Okay, so let's start with putting my pants in one of the biggest packing cubes. So as you just saw, I put seven pairs of pants and one skirt into the cube. And it's looking full now, but... I know that there can be some more stuff stuffed in it. So, my little helper of course. As you can see, there's a little space underneath the mesh here. So I'm just gonna open it up and stuff a few more things here. Are you gonna help? cube I will try to fit as many of my workout clothes as I can. I have all of them here in a pile now. Remember that huge pile I had here? So I could fit almost everything into the cube. All I have left is my gym shorts, not that bad, and two of my like bulkier sports bra. So everything else, like literally everything else, is in here. <laughs> Tightly packed. So two more things. For packing the vitamins, you know vitamins usually come in these huge um, boxes and sometimes, like in this case, it's only half empty. So packing the whole pack as it is, is really a waste of space. So what I'd like to do is to get some more uh, Ziploc bags and just pack the vitamins in these bags. If you're not sure which one is which one or you're afraid that you would be stopped at the airport asked about your pills, especially if you're into fitness and have lots of vitamins and supplements, then you can also uh, write it on the Ziploc bag and then just pack it up like that. <laughs> past 1 p.m. now we just finished lunch and I think I am done with packing so I'll show you what I've got here is my smaller suitcase that's gonna be my carry-on it basically just has <clears throat> one pack of the clothes some like um, porridge and some like smaller bags looks like that this is gonna be my personal item backpack I'm gonna put my laptop in here and it also has like some smaller like notebooks, my water bottle that uh, I'm gonna bring to the airport empty and then fill up there. Yeah, those are gonna be um, in my jacket and those are my toiletries in a clear plastic bag. And here is the suitcase. <clears throat> I will open it up but... It looks pretty messy in here. Um, it is really organized underneath, but then there came the last minute pieces that I forgot to pack, <laughs> so that's why it looks like that. And I just shoved the smaller pieces to wherever I could, so I have some like spices and creams and stuff like that. This um, pocket here is also full of food basically <laughs> food and teas and these kind of things, so yeah. I measured it and the weight limit should be fine. 
So that was it for my packing video guys, I hope you liked it, if you did please give it a thumbs up uh, and subscribe to my channel if you are not already and also you can just leave down in the comments below if you have any other tips or tricks for packing. For me, just to summarize it mostly, it is use packing cubes, use ziplock bags, take the vitamins and medicine and all the, these kind of things out of their container to save space, um, seal your liquids and um, yeah, that's basically it. Just try to think ahead, prepare everything and get packing.